heart transplant process and risks. Heart transplantation is the final treatment step for heart disease. This action is taken if the administration of drugs and other treatment methods is not effective in dealing with the heart problem that you are experiencing. Heart transplantation is the process of removing a heart that is no longer working optimally and replacing it with a heart transplant procedure that is safe to do as long as the patient continues to undergo routine checks afterward. Requirements for performing a heart transplant A heart transplant may be considered if you have the following conditions. Have severe heart failure. Have a low chance of life if you don't get a donor heart. Do not smoke. Have a healthy enough condition to undergo surgery and care during and after the transplant. Willing and able to follow the medical program given by a team of doctors. However, Heart transplantation is not recommended if people with heart disease or heart failure experience the following conditions. Ha have a history of cancer or other high-risk diseases. Old age can affect the body's ability to recover from transplant surgery. Have another disease, severe infection, or obesity. Heart transplant procedure. Heart transplant surgery is performed for the sake of safety and improving the patient's quality of life. Broadly speaking, the following are the stages of a heart transplant. Stage I, finding the right donor. It's not easy to find the right donor. Usually, heart donors come from people who have recently died with good heart conditions, for example due to traffic accidents or brain death. Even though you have found a donor, there are many factors that must be matched, such as blood type, heart size, and how severe the condition of the recipient of the heart donor is. In, in addition, the doctor will also consider the risks that may be faced by donor recipients. It should also be noted that the transfer of the heart from the donor to the recipient should not take more than 4 hours so that the heart continues to function properly. Stage 2, Remove the Recipient's Heart After the right heart is obtained, the doctor will perform a heart removal procedure on the donor recipient. The, the level of difficulty and length of the heart removal process depends on the medical history of the recipient's heart. A heart that has gone through several surgeries generally takes longer and is more difficult to remove. Stage 3, Inserting a Heart from a Donor the process of implantation or placement of the heart into the recipient may be the easiest procedure compared to previous processes. In fact, generally only five stitches are needed so that the heart from the donor can function properly in the new body. This process aims to connect the large blood vessels in the new heart to the blood vessels that will carry blood throughout the body. Heart Transplant Risks before carrying out heart transplant surgery, you and your family can consult with your doctor first to find out what the benefits and risks of this procedure are. Some of the risks that can occur from a heart transplant are 1. Side effects of treatment After a heart transplant, you are required to take immunosuppressant drugs for the rest of your life. This is done to prevent the body from rejecting the transplanted heart. However, if consumed continuously, this drug can cause side effects such as kidney damage. Th therefore, take the drug according to the dosage and instructions given by the doctor. 2. Infection. Immunosuppressant drugs work by suppressing the immune system. Weakening the immune system can make it difficult for infections to heal. Th therefore, it is important to always check heart health conditions regularly, especially in the first year after a transplant. 3. Cancer 
The potential for cancer will increase because the immune system decreases due to taking immunosuppressant drugs. Non-Hodgkin lymphoma cancer is the type of cancer most at risk of developing when you are undergoing treatment after a heart transplant. 4. Problems in the arteries. Thickening and hardening of the arteries is one of the risks after having a heart transplant. This condition makes blood circulation in the heart not smooth and triggers a heart attack, heart failure, or heart rhythm disturbances. 5. Rejection of the new heart by the body. The biggest risk of a heart transplant is the body's rejection of the new heart. To prevent this from happening, it is recommended that you take immunosuppressant drugs that have been prescribed by your doctor and undergo regular doctor checks. In addition, patients are also advised to live a healthy lifestyle and diet, exercise regularly, and control stress after undergoing the transplant process. If you experience certain symptoms after undergoing a heart transplant, such as fever, shortness of breath, and weight gain due to fluid accumulation, immediately check your condition with a doctor so that proper examination and treatment can be carried out.